Tulsa City Council has just voted to ramp up efforts to fight the spread of COVID-19. Adding to the current mask mandate is now a six-foot distancing mandate as well. And fines can be up to $1,200 or six months in jail. News Channel's Burt Mummel live tonight down at City Hall with details. Burt. Mark, churches, banks, gyms, retail establishments, any kind of commercial entity where the public can gather, now they have to have that six foot distance as well. The council hammered out the details over the course of three hours. What they essentially did was they took the mask mandate and on top of that, they added the six foot distancing mandate. Now, restaurants and bars have an exception if they have those plexiglass dividers, that will suffice there. Fines, you can expect to start seeing enforcement of this. If people start to com call and complain, they can call the uh, health department will be enforcing, the working in neighborhoods with code enforcement and even TPD. Now for places like Circle Cinema, who have already been going above and beyond with their prevention efforts, seeing the city step up their game was welcome news. If they do, um put a little more teeth into the ordinance and enforcing it. Hopefully that will just encourage those who were thinking it was optional um, to not think that way anymore and to really try to comply. Going through this and those teeth come in the form of big bucks, fines of up to $1,200 and or six months in jail. The council also voted tonight on large gatherings and the rules that apply to those. Up until now, if you had a gathering of 500 people or more, you had to get approval from the health department as far as your social distance plan. That number has been dropped to 150 people. Now, all of these rules set to expire at the end of January, contingent upon, of course, where COVID stands at that time. Reporting live, Bert Mumla, News Channel 8.